we say that automotive technology is constantly evolving that isn't limited to computer controls, sensors, and sophisticated electronics. It also includes the vehicle's cooling system and its hoses. Coolant hoses are not simple pieces of rubber anymore. And in this video, we're going to talk about some of the changes in the hose design and learn why a complete system repair is the smart way to go. Modular hoses can be found in a wide range of applications, both import and domestic. In fact, virtually every OE manufacturer is moving to the modular hose concept because of its ease of installation on the assembly line and the ability to better manage the flow of coolant throughout today's increasingly complex cooling systems. What traditionally have been simple port-to-port -port hoses that provided a flexible link between individual components in the cooling system have evolved into complex units that take on multiple functions within the cooling system. Some include components such as quick connectors, T's, branched outlets, and more specialized parts. These are called modular hoses. Modular hoses also might include sensor ports, control valves, bleeder valves, check valves, and flow restrictors. With modular hoses taking on more functions and complexity, that means they have more potential failure points than traditional hoses. Failure to properly address these problem areas can lead to issues such as leaks and overheating, requiring your customer to come back a second time for the same general issue. When a plastic quick connect is removed from its spout, the O-ring seat can be lost, meaning that when reconnected, the O-ring no longer conforms to the sealing surface. Also, as the hoses age, O-rings lose their pliability and can get brittle, eventually cracking. Remember, quick connectors utilize specialized O-rings, meaning an off-the-shelf replacement of an O-ring likely will lead to premature leaking from the connection point. Modular hoses come in many forms, but all contain at least one connector, T, or branching component. Many times, these components are made from highly engineered plastic materials. These connectors are exposed to the extreme heat and the vibration of the engine, and over time, they become brittle and break. Failure also can occur anytime the hose is removed for any repair. If an O-ring or branch connection fails on a modular hose, the solution is not as simple as just replacing that component. In most cases, the entire hose assembly must be replaced. You can run into issues with leaking, proper fit, and cooling system operation if a modular hose is installed that doesn't use components that are identical to what came off the vehicle. It's important to only install modular hoses manufactured to OEM standards. Modular hoses are becoming increasingly popular on traditional internal combustion vehicles, and we're seeing more of them in the EV world as well. Be sure to familiarize yourself with the functions and failure points of today's modular hoses and encourage your customers to take a systems approach when replacing them. Every time a modular hose is removed or one of its components is replaced, your customer should replace the entire hose assembly to ensure that the system works properly. Thanks for watching.